Hi, my name is Wahid and I'm a photographer traveling through Southeast Asia. Currently, I'm in Japan and I love taking portraits. So I met this girl, a local Japanese girl. We started talking and uh, yeah, she's a, she enjoys photography too. She's a cosplayer. And today we're meeting up with her. She's wearing a kimono and we're gonna have a little photo shoot through Asakusa. It's gonna be really crowded, quite challenging. On top of that, it's like 34 degrees and it feels more like 41 degrees, my phone says. Uh, yeah, let's go meet her. It's a bit of a hide and seek game. We're trying to find her. She sent a photo. Ah, I think she should be there, man. That looks uh, like the right place. With me, by the way, I have Katspel from Hello. Poland. Yeah. He's helping me film some behind the scenes, a fellow traveler. That's her with the umbrella. The red one. That should be her. <laughs> Konnichiwa, Rino! Oh, hi. We made it! <laughs> Let's go there! This is Rino Chan or Des? I don't know if you're older. Okay, I'm 27. I'm Ah, okay. Yes, then it's Rino Chan. Uh, yeah, this is Rino in a kimono. We met in a hostel. We're gonna have a little photo shoot. So, uh, let's do that. Okay. You ready, Rino? Um, could you just for a second stand here? Yeah, just stand here with your face that way. Already looks really good. And uh, yeah, just like you did before with your legs. Yeah, you can do pose, yes? Yes. Okay, I'll come closer. <laughs> yes, you can just stand here, just hold your umbrella. This would be like more close up. No, no, you can just hold it, hold it. Yeah, like here. Like, yeah, like normal, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. Body a little bit more that way, yeah, yeah. Chin a little bit down, yeah. Let's go that way, let's go that way. <laughs> First time photo shoot or not? I don't know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, you can stand here, maybe place like one hand here and your body's a little bit that way. And then I'll say more, I'll be standing there. And uh, yeah, you're just here, relaxing. I've spent quite a bit of time around this bridge. I felt like there was a photo to be made, but it was rather difficult. The light was really harsh, the bridge was way too bright, it got overexposed because of the color. But then some people cleared up and we got to make some exciting photos. Umbrella a little bit more, yes? Yes. Like it's a little bit almost like, I mean, yeah. And your, your body is like this, but you turn your head that way. I really like how these turned out. The key was to shoot in the shade and to get closer. And look that way. Yeah. Good. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, I really like these. Beautiful. Good to hear. <laughs> let's go. What? Ah, let's go is Josh in Japanese. Yes, let's go is Iko. Iko. Okay. <laughs> yeah, if, if you want something to drink now, water, that's uh, we can buy. Yeah. Yeah. I have coins. Yes, really. Yes. <laughs> Come by. Come by. Come by. Come by. Nice. Oshi? Ah, yes. Very good. <laughs> yeah, it's 
it's really hard. I'm, I'm like totally soaked. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah. At least I smell good. <laughs> ah. Wait, wait. Let me check something. Yeah, man. Nice. Just stand here for a second and look that way. Yeah. Body. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, pagoda. <laughs> okay, Tsugoi, Tsugoi we like to hear. <laughs> yes, very good. Look that way. <laughs> okay. As we were having a little break, Reno started to reapply her lipstick, or lip gloss. I thought this looked really interesting and good, especially with the kimono, this mix of old and new. And so, we made a few more photos. Alright, there are quite literally endless possibilities of photographs to make. Right now I'm on a 20mm lens, it's not often that I use this for portraits, but I think it can work pretty nice if you know the characteristics. And I just want to get everything of this temple in the image. And uh, yeah, I think that'll be pretty interesting. Okay. And uh, lean forward. Yeah, you know, like lean forward, like, like this. Yeah, yes, yes, very good. Yeah. Yes, and chin down a little bit, look into the camera, yeah. Yes. You do have to get quite close with such a wide angle lens. And yes. it's important to keep the face of your model in the center because that's the part where you have the least amount of distortion. But it was actually nice. Yeah, just hold it like this again. Yeah, a bit lower, yeah. And the fingers more like the, this one together, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this one here again, yeah. Lower, yeah. Yeah, so I think we're done for now around the temple, the traditional stuff. There are some really exciting photos. Uh, the shade is very nice. We're now gonna go, I think, just to the city, just to the normal, more modern looking things. Because I like the contrast of a very traditional, beautiful kimono and then just the Japanese streets. So uh, yeah, let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> Japan really doesn't have to be expensive. Before coming here, I was afraid that this would be my most expensive country, but it actually it's actually really reasonable and good. So yeah, pleasantly surprised. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs>
It was a really fun day, time went by way faster than we thought, so after our meal we had about 2 more hours with the kimono before Reno had to return it to the rental store. And I don't want to make this video too long, so here are a few of the photos that we made while walking. What I will show you is my favorite part. Towards the end of the day, the sun was setting and that created some beautiful lighting. And I just love these Japanese streets. They look so old school, I guess. Beautiful shafts of light, the shadows, the textures. And of course, Reno in her kimono with the umbrella backlit. Tired but satisfied. And it was Sugoi. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. It was really a lot of fun. Glad I made a photo All shoot and a video in Japan. Always remember the guys behind the scene. <laughs> bye bye. Sayonara. <laughs> <laughs>